Greetings, everybody. It was Jesse here, and it's a little news report and a, uh, well, I guess if you want to call it a reprove or a rebuke or whatever, but, uh, <clears throat> before I get to the, uh, to that, and, um, if this offends, I'm sorry, but, you know, I, I see this stuff all the time, and, um, and, um, that's not good. But anyways, Romans sixteen seventeen. Now I beseech you, brethren, mark them which cause divisions and offenses contrary to the doctrine which you have learned, and avoid them. For they that are such serve not our Lord Jesus Christ, but their own belly, and by good words and fair speeches deceive the hearts of the simple. So, the reason why I read you those two verses is this right here um, and I noticed this right here 12 million dead bees Florida okay um, I don't know how he got this as a current event um, but he did somehow um, the dead bats dolphins um, Egypt protests I didn't look into that but this was really key right here the uh, dead bats and dolphins yes that is true um, that is very recent okay seven million bats die from uh, WNS we can't stop this thing and it's marching across the country um, talks about the seven million bats and then um, the mass death of dolphins in Peru talks about the 877 carcasses um, very important stuff to keep watch of um, so I'm not faulting them for that, but um, what I am marking him for is this right here. The tens of millions of Florida bees mysteriously dropped dead in one day. And right here, guys, this was from October 5th, 2011. Now, this was the first time I've heard of this article, and it is kind of intriguing. Don't get me wrong, but this was over a year old okay um and he's coming out as it's a as if it's a uh, current event I mean just listen to it cup of coffee get serious get, are you serious 12 million bees have died in Florida overnight no reason nobody has a clue why it wasn't because it was cold Why? hang on no disease. Why? Why? So there you go. And I mean, I've, I've done the search on this, folks. And the only thing that comes up that's recent is, um, okay, well, Rapture Watch has it, but it's just a link right to his video one day ago, okay? Here we go again. Daily Mail. Mysterious honeybee apocalypse. Up to 12 million bees found. When was this? October 3rd, 2011. Okay, hold on a minute. Right there. 3 October 2011. No one knows why. That's exactly what he was saying. So he had to have been referring to this news article. So, but I mean, I mean, don't get me wrong. The bats and the dolphins, yes. That is definitely a current event. Um, and that's the first time I heard about the 12 million dead bees, but to come out here and act like it's a current event, it's not. It happened over a year ago. So, anyway, I will post a link to that, and you can see it for yourself. Um, and, uh, that's all I got. Um, that's that's a perfect example of just skimming through anything you want to put up and then you just put it up okay you can't just do that I mean if you want to reference old history and stuff like that of, of old of older current events that happened a year ago that's fine but to come out and act like it's like some new thing when it's not that's when you have a problem so that's why I read you those two verses again now I beseech you, brethren, mark them which cause divisions and offenses contrary to the doctrine which you have learned, and avoid them. For they that are such serve not our Lord Jesus Christ, but their own belly, and by good words and fair speeches deceive the hearts of the simple. 
That was a deception, folks. That was not new. This That was over a year old. So, until next time, guys. Truth be told, truth be known. Stay safe. God bless. Bye-bye.